We wish to call upon the president to heed to the calls of the church and call for a multi-sectoral consultative and engagement forum to address the concerns raised uh, from various quarters and to seek a lasting solution to the myriad challenges that we face as a nation. We also wish to request the president to rein upon some of his henchmen who want to advance the narrative that the church or certain bishops are, uh, are against and fighting the government or the government agenda. Contrary to such, the church is raising such concerns to correct the government and to call upon the president and the government to retract their steps and seek a way forward. Additionally, we call upon all religious leaders in Kenya to lead in quelling the anger and the anxiety building up in the nation and to uphold our divine role of praying for our leaders and the government and for the peace of our nation. The church cannot and must not be seen to incite the masses or lead protests and fasting. We called upon God to give us leaders that befit us. We cannot call God to correction. These are the leaders we begot ourselves and we must do everything to correct them when they go astray and to work with them. Finally, as prophets and priests of our land, we shall be calling in line with the God's divine prophecy for a national day of prayer, reflection, and reconciliation in a few days where all political and religious leaders will be invited to attend for reflection. The Akurino Church remains committed to pray, work, and partner with the government as long as the government remains open to correction and, and consultation. Ni hawanja kosea. Ile kitu wanajaribu kufanya ni kulekebisha selikali lakini ile je ambaye watu wanaipata ile je ambaye watu wanapata hiyo ripoti naye sio ile je ambaye inafaa. Kwa hivyo tunaunga mkono ya kwamba kanisa inafaa kuongelesha serikali. Dipoza tu, tumkumbushe tukumbushe la hizo wetu yale ambayo tuliahidiana na yeye bado haijatimizwa. Uh, ile kitu nitasema sisi kama kanisa tuko na uhakika akisikia hii sauti atakubali kukaa chini na kanisa na tutaongele sana na mambo itakuwa mzuri kwa sababu sisi ni asikize sauti ya kanisa na sisi tumusikilize tujue mwelekeo uko pande gani kati tulikuwa kwake Karen tukiomba juu ya tendo lilikuwa limetendeka alituita tukaomba tukiwa makuhani na tuliomba na ile jambo ikamalizika akatuambia siku moja nitamuita state house ikuru tuwe tukisema bwana asifiwe hajatuita sasa tunamwambia na tumemshii atuite kwa umati wote basi tuende tuombe na njia itaonekana nataka yeye atualike tuende tuongee na ninasema tusiitwe wakorinu peke yake Zehebu zote za kanisa tuitwe ili tukaombe tusuruhishe hii ugonja uliokuwa nchi yetu sababu nchi yetu iko na ugonjwa